traveled back in time with me, about 330 million years ago, to a place that looks nothing like the Scotland we know today. Imagine a world of vast, steamy, coal swamps, giant ferns and bizarre, towering trees create a dense, green canopy overhead. The air is thick, humid, and buzzing with the sounds of colossal insects. But beneath the dark, murky waters of these ancient wetlands, something truly massive is on the hunt. This is the domain of Rhizotus Hiberti, a prehistoric leviathan that ruled these waters. Forget any fish you've seen before. Rhizotus was a true giant, a lobe-finned predator that could grow up to seven meters long at S. The size of a large saltwater crocodile, its long, streamlined body was a torpedo of muscle, perfectly built for explosive bursts of speed through the tangled, submerged landscape of roots and fallen trees. It was the apex predator of its time, a true king of the Carboniferous swamps. What made Risuda so terrifying wasn't just its size, but its incredible weaponry. Its mouth was a nightmare trap, lined with an array of sharp teeth. But the real stars of the show were two enormous, tusk-like fangs that jutted out from its lower jaw. These formidable weapons, each measuring up to 22 centimeters long, were designed for one purpose. To impale and secure large prey, scientists believe Rizidus would launch a devastating ambush attack from below, using its powerful body to surge upwards and strike its unsuspecting victim, which likely included large amphibians and other fish. With its prey firmly impaled, Rosidus would then drag it down into the depths to consume it. This brutal hunting strategy made it one of the most successful and feared predators of the Paleozoic era. For millions of years, Rosidus, Hiberti, reign supreme, a testament to the incredible and sometimes terrifying diversity of life that has existed on our planet. Its fossils, found in the coal deposits of Scotland give us a chilling glimpse into a lost world dominated by this magnificent freshwater monster. Thanks for joining me on this deep dive into prehistoric Scotland. If you enjoyed learning about the mighty Rhizotus, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell so you never miss another journey into the past. See you next time.